in my previous video about mental models, I have talked about cognitive biases a little bit. But this is the formal explanation of cognitive biases. So as usual, if we break down the words, we have cognitive and biases. First, let's look at the word cognitive. The core word for cognitive is actually cognition. The formal definition of cognition would be the mental action or process of acquiring knowledge and understanding through thought, experience and the senses. As always, the formal definition sounds convoluted. Let's break it down a little bit. Cognition is actually the process of acquiring, processing and understanding knowledge. In other words, it can be the process of thinking. Your cognition is how you think. The second word we had was bias. This is actually an easy one. Bias means inclination towards something. So, if we combine these two words, we get cognitive bias and we would have inclination to a way of thinking. The actual definition of cognitive bias would be the systematic error in human decision making and information processing. If we put it in simple terms, cognitive biases are loopholes in your mind that do not let you think properly. If you have one or more cognitive biases in your brain, your perception of reality is not actually going to match the actual reality itself. I think examples are best ways to understand these. Let's say that you might have a cognitive belief that everyone thinks bad of you. Even your spouse, your boss, your neighbor, everybody. Then, even when you are not at fault, you might think that others are going to blame you for everything. As we all know, that is not usually the case. And on the complete opposite end of that spectrum would be the thought that everything is always going great and absolutely no one can blame you for anything. That way, even if something goes wrong and it is your fault, you are not likely to take the blame for it. Both of these thought processes are inherently wrong, as in they do not match the reality. You are going to be good at something and you are going to be bad at something. Nothing happens in absolute all the time. The problem with cognitive biases is that you aren't even aware of the fact that if you have one or more of these biases or not. The only way to make sure that you don't have any biases is to educate yourself with these biases. Once you know what these biases are and how they affect us in our lives, you will be able to avoid them in your day-to-day -day life. But for now, I would like to thank you all for watching. I hope you learned something new today. And my request to you would be to subscribe to this channel so that I understand that people want this kind of content and I will keep making them. And for the bonus part, I would like to say the Spanish for do you understand is entiendes and the Spanish for I understand is entiendo and the Spanish for I don't understand is no entiendo and that is the official end of this video